swarm of UFOs sighted near the sun through infrared camera. Another great discovery made by Gina Maria Colvin Hill. On September 21, 2018, at 8.30 a.m., using an infrared camera she was able to videotape a swarm of UFOs surrounding our sun. Take a look. September the 21st, 2018, this is an infrared view of the sun, and the little UFOs, I guess that's what they are, or orbs next to the sun. There was clouds earlier, but they seem to have dissipated somewhat. And it's supposed to rain later today, I guess. <laughs> yes. But this is our sun in the sky. And when I get through doing the infrared, I'm going to uh, see if there's any more ships and stuff with the other camera. Yeah, somebody wanted to see the grid pattern on this lens thing right here for some reason. That's what they wanted to see last time, but yeah, this is the sun. You're very welcome, Christine. Yeah, I can see some comments. I put a different set of uh, infrared filter on. I mean, it's the same type. These were a little newer. But yeah, this is our sun. At one time when I was doing um, an infrared, there were the elongated, like cigar shaped um, ships also that descended from underneath the sun in one of my other videos and pictures and uh, we had the white ones too we I mean we had these circular ones right beside the elongated ones and I don't know what was going on with that but yeah they showed up one day all of a sudden I think that was around a month or so back I guess I lose track I take so many videos and pictures but this is the sun right now in the sky and I'm really hoping there's a flurry of activity by that egg-shaped object or whatever it is mothership I don't know what it is really what are the lights around the Sun there's some type of a UFO or orb Okay, it's not normal because I'm looking with my bare eyes and I can't see anything but the sun and some white fogginess in the sky. And these things right here, they can move in an instant. I've got them on other videos 
where you'll be looking and then boom, they move. Oh wow, I figured out how to block someone while viewing. That's a pretty neat thing. All right. Okay, well I'm gonna get off here because I really do wanna take those pictures at the same time I do this infrared. I could just sit here and hold this and when I see the, the commenters, I can just push block and then just block them. Yeah, but then that's a waste of my time. And I don't want to stoop to that level of, you know, what these people are doing, because that's not me. Yeah. But I'm glad you all are enjoying everything I'm posting. I don't like to try to do overload. That's, you know, I, I know it's all, it's really overwhelming. But I'm going to, uh, my hair don't look too good, but you know what, I'm going to flip this around right now. And, um, yeah, it is so, so bright. I'm going to flip it around, and I'm going to show you what the sun looks like right now in the sky. Okay. That's the sun right there. And we're going to end it at that. Well, I went out there, and I took a picture facing the eastern sky with the sun rising. And I was able to pick something up, and I was able to see what was to the left of the, um, I'm going to turn this around, the left of this. And look, we've got more things right here. More of this. And more ships. There's that uh, little frequency thing right there also. I'm going to turn up this volume. Well, it, okay, it's a, there's that frequency thing right there. Yeah, but these ships, they're in like a different formation. They're all over the place. And there really is so many of them. And we can see that they are clearly ships. They got this black stuff on them. But I thought that was pretty neat to see more of these things right here on the side of this object, whatever this is, this egg shape and all these ships. This was the best photo that I had that had the most detail in it. But I've posted these on my timeline and um, I tried to get a picture of all the ships that were around it and stuff. And there are, there's gobs of ships out there. And Gina, how are you catching these? I don't know, I, there is no human explanation, okay? I could be tapping into another realm dimension or perhaps whatever's out there i'm meant to catch on here for to share with people okay i don't know what we're looking at but it definitely is something that we don't see every day okay i don't even know if you see these in sci-fi things but there's all these objects out there yeah, there's another one of those um, double-decker things, whatever they are, ships. But look at them. They're all over the place. And if I, if I get a photo before I leave and go to work, and maybe I can work on it. If maybe I can get some more things. But yeah, these are all over the place. The photos are on my timeline. And... Um, these are different objects to the side of the sphere or whatever it is. I wanted, I knew there was something over there. I just wanted to see what was on the other side. It's like we're looking at in a, a whole new universe or something. It's, it's so strange. And I know people are commenting, but I'm not looking at the comment because I'm trying to concentrate on what I'm showing you before people, you know, some people can't zoom up 
that well and this tends to be able to get you a closer view of what we're looking at up there in the skies. These things are out there or I would not be capturing them. We may not be to see them right now with our naked eye, but I'm sure we will eventually see these things and they are on my timeline, these photos. And um, yeah, that's a, sh these are just all over there. And it's kind of dark and gloomy to look at these things, but they're there. But look at that. There's one down there. And look at these ships. They're clearly ships. And there's another frequency thing. That's what someone called them. And, um, yeah, I mean, <laughs> I like to do infrared, but you know what? This has a lot more excitement to it, and there's not much to get in infrared today. This is cloudy and overcast, but look at those frequency symbols. Whatever those things are, I don't know what they are. Now, yeah, this is below it. Just look at them. This is all from one picture, and I've included the original photo on here. I really have. They're just everywhere. And they appear to be the same type. These right here, the, the, these blacks and white, I think they're up there in the clouds at times too. I really do, but I think that's really nice. They'd be able to capture that again because, you know, we didn't know. And there's some like that egg shaped thing. And you can see there's little ships around there also and up there and all around it. But this is like the original image right here. Yeah, I don't know. It really is like an, another universe we're looking at or something. But yeah, you can see all these objects and stuff. And I will try to, if I can, which I did, to like darken certain areas to bring out those objects better. Okay, but yeah, there's that thing again. I don't know what type of ship this is that where it like goes together like that, okay? But okay, I don't really like to make long videos, okay? And I don't know how long I've been talking. <laughs> yeah, but that's pretty neat. I think it is pretty neat seeing those things because it's exciting, but then in a way, you know, it could be a little scary. But you know, at least you're seeing what's out there right now. And you know, you can let it sink in and come to terms with what's out there and hopefully it'll help you along okay we're going to flip this around but thank you for coming to my facebook page for being my friend and sorry i cannot accept any more friend requests there may be that instant where i may accept a friend request but as of now um it's probably around 800 now and there's way too many to go through and when i just accept certain people I don't know who I'm accepting and that's when I get these bad comments that I get on here anyway but you know what it's not going to stop me okay I'm still going to take pictures and I'm just tune them out you know this is this is bigger than them okay I am beyond that all right let's flip this around and we're going to end it right there but this is what I caught this morning facing the eastern sky with the sun all I could see is it was the sun in the sky with the clouds but I just turned on my flash I took the picture and um, went through it and this is what happened okay yes